Alright guys, welcome back to another uh, Let's Play Batman Arkham Asylum. This is you too young for this. And we are still collecting secrets. And we got a... A... Uh, interview tape, that's what it is. Interview tape of Killer Croc. Right off the bat, I'm coming to Crocs Lair. We have a couple of, uh, a few Riddler challenges. Alright, where are we going? We're going this way because there's a Riddler trophy all the way over on this side of the murky water. On the other side of the pond! Uh, we're not in the ocean, nor are we in England. But... Yeah, we have to come over this way. Hello, Croc. Hello, Croc. Sorry about putting you in that hole. Say our last farewells to Killer Croc. Come over here, and... Where are you? There you are, right above me. Crazy evil designers. I always put things above me instead of right at my level. Yeah. It's actually pretty fun. I, I... I like having stuff like that. Alright. Here we go, back in the old sewer. Whoa, this guy is glitched out. There we go, he's not glitching anymore. Alright. And come in here, few things in here that we can get. One of them happens to be right above us. Again. It's a breakable wall that you can only break with the Ultra Bat Claw. That we got near the end of the game. Grab the trophy, drop back down, and we get visited by the ghosty again. It must have been Crane. Another one who doesn't deserve And I think I picked this up before, but yeah, whatever. Joker in particular <laughs> Like I said in part one, the very first part, I hate I games with autosave. Actually, I like them if I'm playing through normally, but when I'm let's playing a game, I don't like it when it auto saves on me. Where are we? Where is it? There's a bombable wall around here somewhere. And like I said, I passed it! Yay! Bomb. But yeah, normally, auto saves save my life. There are times when I am playing a game and I forget to save forever, you know, I go around and start doing stuff, and I haven't saved in about an hour or so, and, uh, and let's see, these guys are, I mean, I've been getting your challenges for a while. Anyway, if I have not gotten it yet in this LP, there is a Riddler trophy right here, so... Just uh, double checking my bases, covering my bases, and whatnot. Because I don't want to get comments and all that stuff or messages saying, hey, you forgot a bloody trophy and you didn't show it. Yes, I know, and I've been trying to rectify that by recording other save files so yeah I've been trying to guys I'm sorry if I keep on messing up but it's 
technically... Uh, okay. Riddler trophy right here again that I have gotten on a different save file. And there is a hidden question mark right there. Which apparently I haven't gotten on my on this file yet. Usually if I get that trophy up there, I also get that hidden question mark. Alright. Trying to figure out... I know where one of those two are. And the rest of them in here are all uh, Riddler trophies. So no more of the hidden question marks. No, well, there are, a f I believe, like a few more of the, well, of course there are a few more of the Arkham Amadeus ones, right? Is it, do we have all the, yeah, we have one more to go in this area. Cool. All right, so. All right, let's see if this one's good. Right after the first fallen column, jump across, grab our line launcher. Oop, yep, there it is, Riddler Trophy. Yay, we found the Riddler Trophy. And we got the Scarecrow unlocked. Yay. Let's see if I can find the, uh, that other one right up there. I am... All right, guys, I think I've found it. Yep, it's right here. It's an interview tape. Durr. All right, Waylon Jones again. And before we enter in this door, let's go ahead and uh, bug zap it. Alright, at us. Because we didn't bug zap at this electric wall when we were facing that fugly guy over there. Would be up. Cool. Alright. So, yay, we are almost done. And we need the Ultra Bat Claw. Break down this wall right here. And in it is a Riddler trophy. Joker trophy. Same thing. I don't know. And then over on this other side of the room, we have another breakable wall. And in this breakable wall we have, if we can get up there, bats. Uh, not there. There. We have Amadeus Arkham Chronicle. And... I am the spirit of Amadeus Arkham. Even yeah, though as you can see, long since passed, his spit enough patience. of you, You're Edward Nigma. We have decrypted your cryptic encryption code of crypticness. We will get you eventually. But in the meantime, as I was saying before, I was so rudely interrupted. Um, yeah, that's number 23. If you guys were keeping track, that is number 23 of the Amadeus Arkham uh, Chronicles. And there's 24. Where's the 24th one, I might say? Well, that's the thing. It's not considered part of the Riddler challenge. kind of interesting. But what you must do is you must figure out the clues 
to figure out who Amadeus Arkham truly is. Interview tape. Last one. Patient interview. Waylon Jones, a.k.a. Killer Croc. Last night, the patient was pacified after a breakout event. And, and we got every trophy. Cool. Yeah, so, basically, all you have to do is, uh, listen to every single, well, not every single one, but pretty much, uh, key ones in, uh, of the Amadeus Arkham guy, and he will drop clues and hints about who he really is, and you just have to go through and, uh, figure out who he really is to find where the last Chronicle is. Oh, I didn't get the last trophy in intensive treatment. Fine. Die. Let us go to intensive treatment to pick that last trophy up. Here we are in the room where we fought all the guards and the exploding gargoyles in the intensive treatment area. If we come down this way where the guard had so kind of let us out at the very beginning of the game. You'll see this Riddler trophy that I so blat blatantly forgot. I'm sorry about that, guys. Uh, blast the wall down. Gra grab the Riddler trophy. What? You did it? You must have cheated. There is no way you could have beaten me. Well, you asked for it, Batman. My final challenge for the whole of Gotham is just seconds away. What? Yep, that's it for the Riddler Challenge. So, next time, guys, we shall figure out who Amadeus Arkham truly is and also figure out... figure out... be able to go face off with Joker. Now, and, uh, yeah, we'll probably sp be splitting up the final fight into two parts. Don't want to. I will try to put it into one part. But anyway, enough of me yakking. I shall see you guys later. Keep it frosty.